small Watch the clock ticking Hi everyone, so I hope you're really okay Welcome back to my channel and hello to a brand new video At long last, I am sat here filming my Halloween haul Guys, this week has been absolutely crazy I have been so busy I was supposed to film this haul video yesterday But honestly, I just have so much going on right now So it's 6 o'clock in the evening currently I'm determined to get this video filmed I look a hot mess, I've been running errands all day I've literally walked through the door Not even touched my makeup off Just put some lipstick on So yeah, I just wanted to say Please excuse my face Because if it looks a hot, sweaty mess There is a reason But anyway, enough of the ramble Today, as you can see from the title I am filming my Halloween haul video Which I am just beyond excited to share with you I feel like Halloween in the UK just isn't really a thing Honestly, it's so infuriating for us UK guys because we just don't have the goods like you Americans do. Honestly, if you live in America, I am so jealous and envious of you and all the amazing stuff you can get for fall and Halloween. We can honestly get nothing like that over here. The only place we really have to shop for Halloween is HomeSense. And don't get me wrong, they have some lovely bit, but... I want selection, I want choice. I want to be able to go in like multiple shops and be able to get loads of amazing things for my home and decorate and stuff. But yeah, like I said, we're just not big on Halloween over here yet. Yet. There is hope. There is hope that one day we do go crazy with Halloween, but yeah, unfortunately we don't. But saying that, I've always been a big Halloween lover, not as much as my friend Jess. I feel like since I've met her, I've got into it 10 times more. But yeah, I've always loved Halloween growing up, you know, going trick-or-treating, you know, dressing up and just having fun. But now I'm in my own place. I feel like I can enjoy it even more because I can decorate, I can go all out. And yeah, I mean, any excuse to decorate your house, right? Oh, we've got a little guest joining us. Hi, baby. Do you want to come in the video? But anyway, I really want to sit down and film this Halloween haul because I went a little bit mad in TK Maxx Home Sense the other day. That is really the only sort of store that sells like home decor, I would say. And they had a massive sale on. This is what I'm saying. Like Halloween isn't even here yet. Like it's still, how long is it? A couple of weeks away. And everything was reduced in Home Sense. Like it was half price. So I had to pick everything up because I know that next year I will then be stocked up and obviously this year as well. Um, I'm thinking of actually maybe doing a Halloween decor video too. I know I've already done like a full Halloween and had some pumpkins and stuff in that but that wasn't really a Halloween decor so if you want to see my Halloween decor do let me know. But yeah like I said Home Sense DK Maps had a massive sale on. So yeah I really wanted to film this today so that you guys now you've got the weekend off if you do want to go and pick up some bits from Home Sense then you can and you can also see what sort of stuff they might have in your local home sense. I also nipped into Poundland to get a few bits as well. I always find that Poundland are really good just for like the odd little decor bits. Anyway, I'm going to shut up because I feel like this intro is so rambly and lengthy. So yeah, if you want to see my Halloween haul and what I have picked up, then please continue watching. So jumping straight in, the first thing I picked up was this little mummy sort of like bowl. So this is what it looks like. Oh my God, guys, how cute is this? So this was originally $5.99, reduced down to £3, which is such a bargain. And yeah, it's just this beautiful, like, mummy sort of bowl. I thought this would be really good in particular to have, like, sweets in on the side. Which then brings me on to the next thing which I picked up, which were these little pumpkin chocolate sweets to fill in here, as you can see. I have got another bag which has fell out all in the bag. Um, so yeah, as you can see, just these little pumpkin balls. Um, I bought two bags of these. And these were originally, guys. $4.99. $4.99 for chocolate. I don't know about you, but I feel like that's quite pricey. But you know what? Have you guys ever actually tried the chocolate from Home Sense TK Maxx? I bought a big bag of like these silver balls last year for like my Christmas little pot that I always have with chocolates in. And they were so pricey and I never tried one for ages. Then Aaron was like, are they just for display or can we try them? I was like, oh yeah, you can try one if you want. And when we tried them, they literally went down within days because the chocolate was so good. So yeah, maybe there's a reason why they're $4.99. But anyway, they were reduced down to £2, which obviously was a price that I was happy to pay. So yeah, I got a couple of bags just to fill that up. And I'm going to put that on the side, which is really, really cute. And then the next thing I picked up from at Home Sense was this little like snow globe, although it's not a snow globe, like confetti globe. Um, I don't actually know what they're called. Is that what they're called? But you know what I mean, guys. Like, you shake it up, and then it has all of the black confetti in, and this one has pumpkins in. Um, and then it's obviously got, like, a pumpkin on the bottom. I just thought this was really cute. I wouldn't normally buy this, but because it was reduced, 
you know, it felt like it was acceptable. So this should have been £15, which I feel like is pricey, um, but it was reduced down to 7 which I was okay with paying, and I then discovered it does this. Let me show you. I'll sing it to you as well. Ding dong, the wicked witch is dead. <laughs> oh my god, how cool is that? I love that. I just love that. That's going to be playing forever now, isn't it? The next thing I picked up from HomeSense was this black school with this sort of like tiara and diamante detailing on. So funny because my mum actually picked me some of this stuff up from HomeSense, which I'll get onto in a minute. So she was in HomeSense and she's like, oh my God, there's so much good stuff. Like, do you want me to pick some up? And she was like, send me pictures. I was like, yes, get that, get that, get that. But she didn't actually get me this. And when I shown her that I got this school, mum was like, oh, I've seen loads of them. I didn't think you would like them. And I'm going to be honest, I didn't know if I did like them, but I just thought I had so much like pumpkin decor and stuff that I don't know, I feel like I needed to put something else in the mix. So I just thought this black little skull would go somewhere nicely on the side. I feel like you always end up having a space somewhere where you're like, oh, I just need something to go there. So because it was only £3, reduced down from £7, I thought I'd pick it up for £3. So yeah, I picked up that little black skull as well. Okay, moving on to this big bag. So these are the bits my mum picked up for me. Um, so the first thing I got was another big pumpkin. So this is actually an LED light up pumpkin. Oh my God, that is literally pathetic. I think it must be broke guys because I mean it's so dim you can't even see it but this was reduced from £10 to £5 I just absolutely love that that would look great outside the front door decorated or even just like on a side somewhere in the house um, so yeah I got that the next thing mum picked up for me as well was this cat sitting on a pumpkin obviously you guys know I absolutely love cats so anything cat related I'm gonna buy and um, this was reduced to seven pounds so I feel like it was 15 pound before um, but yeah another little cute piece of decor that I'll just randomly put somewhere in the house the next thing I got from HomeSense were some pumpkin marshmallows I actually had my eyes on these a few weeks ago when I went to HomeSense because I was actually gonna get like a small cookie jar and fill one of them up with these and I thought that would look so great on the countertop in the kitchen for Halloween but do you know how much these were full price these were $8.99 and I just felt like it was so steep just for some pumpkin marshmallows I mean don't get me wrong they look absolutely incredible but yeah I don't even like marshmallows so I just couldn't pay £9 for them but they were reduced down guys to wait for it four pounds so yeah i'm so glad i managed to get them because i feel like four pounds it just makes the price just makes everything better guys so yeah got some of those this one is heavy the next thing i picked up from home sense was another pumpkin decor statue thingy magic um, and yeah this is blooming heavy guys as you can see it's just sort of like three pumpkins i feel like they did this in white as well but they obviously wasn't there and this was £16, reduced down to £8. And it actually lights up. So if I turn it on, I don't know if you can see that. No, you probably can't see that. But yeah, there's like a candle in the middle as well and it lights up. So this would look like really nice maybe on the floor in the living room where my lanterns are, in the hallway. I don't know where it's going to go, but yeah. I feel like this is gonna look really cool, so I've got that too. Okay, next we move on to mugs. Now, I feel like autumn mugs, fall mugs, well, I mean autumn, fall, same thing, Halloween mugs, they're just impossible to get hold of in the UK. Nice ones, I mean nice ones. I don't just mean like, you know, a plain gingham mug or something. I want about actual Halloween autumn mugs, you know, the pumpkin spice ones, hello fall, hello autumn. The actual nice Halloween mugs with pumpkins on and pumpkin spice and we just don't have them in the UK. Like I see so many beautiful pictures on Pinterest of all these gorgeous Halloween and autumn mugs and then I type them in on Google and don't get me wrong, I feel like you can get your hands on them but they take like four weeks to import from America. They're at 40 pound per mug. And it's just so, like I said again, frustrated. Anyway, I was trying to get my hands on some nice mugs for me and Jess because we're having a sort of like Halloween day on Saturday tomorrow. Oh, and again, the, all the good ones in the UK are sold out. Um, I mean, I never have this one. Hey, but I think Jess actually has this one as well. So this is probably like one of the nicest ones I have. But apart from that, that's it. So anyway, the other day I was trying to like go on the hunt in town to find these Halloween mugs, but guys, there was nothing anywhere. Apart from these two from HomeSense, which were actually in the sale. So yeah, I mean, I'm not like mad mad on them, but I love the orange and the black and yeah, they're quite cute. So as you can see, they're just these orange handle, they've got orange inside and they've sort of got like a haunted castle on them and they're like black and like ripped ripped rich <laughs> 
So yeah, they reduced from £4 to £3 each. So there was two and I just thought it'd be nice to have matching mugs. So I got us both one of these mugs. I then picked up a tea towel. Now we actually picked up a few little bits for Jess because like I said, Jess is Halloween mad too. And she actually looked after my cats and house sitted for me whilst I was away the other week. And she wouldn't let me give her any money for it. So when I was in home sense and this sale was on, I asked her if there was anything she wanted. And she was like, oh yeah, could you pick that up? And I was like, right, that's it. You're not paying me back. I'm getting these as a treat for you. So, first thing I picked up for her were these tea towels. And they say, hey boo. And they've got this little cute ghost on. I absolutely love them. And then the second one is just a plain silver one. These were reduced from £8 to £4. I then picked her up this little pumpkin with this little witch in. This was £8 reduced down to £4. Again, just little things like this just help like bulk out your decor, I feel. And I mean, when you're only paying like £4 for things like this, it just, I think it's really good value. The next thing I picked up was this little sort of like, I don't even know, like banner, we're going to call it. And it just says beware. And it's just got this string attached to it. And it's got pumpkins up here. Again, just another thing that I thought I could hang somewhere and just add to the Halloween decor. And this was only £3 down from £6. So yeah, I really, really liked that. I then picked up this pumpkin. Again, I got this for Jess. Now this was £10 reduced down to £5. And as you can see, it's just simply an orange pumpkin with these little like skeletons all over it. I love that. I absolutely love that pumpkin. I think that would look so nice again, sort of like outside on your outdoor decoration if you do that. Or, you know, again, if you want an indoor decoration, you could equally put that somewhere in your house. But yeah, I love that. Okay, moving on to the last thing that I got from HomeSense, and it was these little cat napkins. So me and Jess are actually having like a Halloween type dinner tomorrow. So we're going pumpkin picking in the day and having like a really cute day. And then in the evening, we're having a Halloween dinner. We're having a Halloween girls night. You know, we're getting the Halloween PJs out, the Halloween mugs, the Halloween face masks. Just a really nice girly pamper evening. And we really wanted to go all out and have like a Halloween dinner. And obviously decorate the table all halloween -y and stuff. So yeah, we thought these little cat napkins would be so cute for the table. And these were reduced down from 2 50 to £1.30. So I love those as well. Okay, so that was pretty much everything that I got from Home Zens. Next, I'm going to move on to what I got from Poundland. So I think in total, I spent like £10 in Poundland. And do you know when you come out of Poundland, I'm always like, oh my God, I've got a massive bag and I only spent £10. Like it's just, I mean, I know that's common sense, but... I just love Pamela for that feeling. I love walking out of a big bag, but yet only knowing that I spent £10. Does that make sense? So, first thing I picked up from Poundland was some reusable straws. So, this is what they look like. Just black straws with these little pumpkins on. Just thought they were really cute. The next thing I got from Poundland was some Halloween crackers for our Halloween table decor. I mean, I'm not going to lie. You don't get the nicest things inside. You, you get inside either a centipede, a cockroach, a spider ring, a fly, or some pumpkin stickers. I feel like the pumpkin stickers are the ones where you're winning if you get that like prize. Um, but yeah, anyway, a pan. I just thought they were really good. You know, I'm not going to lie. I do think the Halloween crackers are probably more for the kids than for me and Jess. But anyway... Whatever looks good on the table, we're having. So we got some of those. I then also picked up a tablecloth. So this is just a lacy spiderweb tablecloth from Poundland and obviously on pound. I then also picked up this little decor piece from Poundland and it is a light up ghost. I haven't actually got any batteries in. Oh wait, it has got batteries in. It comes with batteries. Oh, I thought I was gonna have to, I don't even think you're gonna be able to see that. Um, but yeah, it lights up and it was only a pound, so. I really like that little ghost. How cute is he? I then picked up this orange little bowl. I mean, I guess this is what normal people would have, you know, next to the front door for trick or treaters. But I can 100% say that I am not going to have trick or treaters this year. I live in the countryside, so there's literally no one around. I'd be so surprised if I have a trick or treater. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd get this anyway, just for the side and just to put some sweets in, just just for decor purposes. I don't know, I just really liked it. So yeah, I got that. But I mean, if you do have trick or treaters, this would be nice to put next to your front door and you can fill it with sweets. So then when your trick or treaters come, you can just go, come oh, on, pick a sweet. Or you could make gift bags for your trick or treaters. Oh my goodness. I would actually love to have a street where the kids actually come to the door because 
Oh, I've never been able to do that. Even at my old house, my mum and dad, no one would ever come to our door because we lived in a cul-de-sac and it was dark and yeah, just it just wasn't just wasn't the place of trick or treaters. The next thing I picked up from Poundland was some spider web. So this is just like cobweb stuff, but I thought this would be really good for decor um, and just to put everywhere. It's got like little spiders in. So yeah, only a pound, so love that. The next thing I picked up from Poundland was some pumpkin lights. Now, Poundland are honestly the absolute best for lights. If you want some little lights just to light up like your sides, your TV cabinet, wherever it may be, honestly, go to Poundland and save your pennies. They have pumpkin lights, they had orange lights, they had spider lights, they had every single light you could think of. Now, I picked up some from Morrison's and they were £3, which I actually thought was really inexpensive, but I went into Poundland and they had some so similar in there for a pound, so yeah, definitely check out Poundland for lights. Um, but I picked up these ones and these are like little circle pumpkins, which I absolutely love. So yeah, I picked up a pack of them. I also picked up this little Halloween bucket. Again, I, I don't know what I'm doing with this, guys, because I'm not a kid. I mean, as you can see, <laughs> I don't go trick-or-treating. And this is a trick-or-treating bucket, isn't it? Do you know, like, when you're back in the day and you go around knocking on everyone's door and you have your little bucket and you're like, trick-or-treat, and then they give you the treats. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I just really wanted the bucket, guys, so I got the bucket. And then the last thing I picked up from Poundland was some Halloween tinsel. This is three metres. They did this in purple as well, but I really wanted to go with this sort of like orange and black decor around my house. To be fair, I wish I actually got a little bit more of this. I may go and get more, but yeah, absolutely love that tinsel. So I got that as well. I feel like Poundland had a really good Halloween on actually. So yeah, quite impressed with Poundland. Right, now we're gonna move on to miscellaneous bits and bobs that I picked up. So the next two things I picked up for Halloween were some face masks. So as I said, I'm having Halloween like pamper night in with Jess tomorrow. So I wanted to get us both a face mask. Now, try and find a pumpkin face mask. Let me tell you, I don't know if anyone's ever tried to look for Halloween face masks, but it's a bloody nightmare. There is nowhere that does Halloween face masks. But like I said, it's because the UK doesn't celebrate it. Uh, but I managed to track these two down on the internet. They were from Look Fantastic. They were not the cheapest. They were £8 each, I think. But... I just really wanted them, so I got them. Um, so yeah, this is what they look like. How cute are they? They're gonna look so cute, like alongside our PJs all laid out, our mugs. If you saw mine and Jess's like cute night in the other week, like a few weeks ago, we laid out, well, I laid out for Jess, like some pajamas, a really nice mug, a face mask, just bits and bobs, and I love doing that. I love, I love it guys, I just love nothing more than a cosy night in with your best friend, you know, getting loads of treats and stuff laid out. There's just nothing better in life, you know? So yeah, got us both one of those. I also picked up on Amazon a Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte Body Cream. This is from Bath & Body Works. Again, we don't do Bath & Body Works in the UK, so if you ever wanna get anything, you have to go on Amazon or eBay and pay like over the odds for everything. But I'm actually doing a sort of like Halloween, autumn, evening pamper routine next week. Oh my God, that video has been so highly requested, so yeah finally doing it for you next week and I really wanted to include something more sort of like Halloween, autumn-y scented. Um, so yeah, got my hands on this. I think I paid like £16, something ridiculous for it, but it smells absolutely insane. I also picked up from Amazon um, something for my cat. Now, one of their little outfits hasn't actually arrived yet. It's actually coming tomorrow. Um, and I got them like a little pumpkin outfit. And the other outfit I got for them both was this little bat wings. So it literally just is Velcro and just attaches around the neck like a collar. Um, and it has little wings. I mean, I'm not going to lie, they weren't that impressed. But obviously I'm not going to keep it on them if they don't like it. Um, I just wanted it more just for a cute picture of them both on Halloween. So, yeah. I, I put it on Boo and she didn't mind it. Like, she was walking around. I think it was more Buddy that was just, like, scared of Boo when she had these on. Like, Buddy was literally looking at Boo like, oh my god, what has happened to you? So, yeah, anyway, they were only a few pounds. So, you got two in a pack. It does actually have a little pumpkin bell on, but I had to take that off because I don't think they were that impressed about the wings anyway. But having that on, they just hated it. So, once I took it off, they, they were cool. They were okay with the wings. So, yeah. Okay, next thing I picked up was from New Look. Oh my god, these were free for six pounds. Oh my god, so I could have got another pair. Oh my god, that's so dumb, Laura. Oh, 
doesn't that annoy you when you go to the checkout and you buy something and like I know that when I worked in retail if there was an offer and I knew about the offer which you normally do know about the offers when you're in store you know I'd be like especially at like something like this which is like a permanent offer for new look I'd be like oh you've only got two socks why don't you get another one because it's only going to be like an extra pound for another one so these socks are 250 each or it's three for six pound but I didn't stupidly know and the lady didn't even tell me I could have got another pair of socks guys for one pound fifty less that's so frustrating. Anyway, I was here to show you the socks. So I picked me and Jeff a pair of Halloween socks up. Again, I feel like this is something I've had to hunt so hard for. Something so simple like Halloween socks. I mean, Christmas socks, you can just go into bloody Asta and buy a pair. But Halloween socks, they just don't do them anywhere. New Look was honestly like the only place I saw Halloween socks. So yeah, they did a few different pairs actually, but these were like the nicest pair in my opinion. Um, and this says here for the booze and they've got little ghosts on and they're orange. They are just so adorable. So yeah, these were 2 49 each or they would have been three for six. I'm gonna go on about that all night now, aren't I? But yeah, anyway, got myself and Jess those. I also picked something else up from New Look, which isn't actually Halloween related, but I'm gonna show you anyway. Cause I feel like these things you have to get in there now and buy. I was just go but wait we just gotta take a minute for this moment this is the first thing Christmassy I'm showing you on my channel of this year oh my god I picked up only a Christmas mug oh my god so it says brew Dolph on and it has the cutest little Rudolph oh my god is that chip no it's not chip and it has the cutest little Rudolph on I just absolutely love this mug guys you know I'm a mug lover anyway and obviously Christmas is around the corner and I always find that New Look do the best mugs ever. So yeah, couldn't resist getting that whilst I was in there. So yeah, got my first Christmas mug. Okay, so going back to Halloween, I only have one more thing to show you and it is from Lush. Now, when I went online, they had so many Lush Halloween, like bath bombs, bubble bars, things like that. But when I went in store, they literally only had one that I wanted. There was four online that I wanted. But when I went in store, they only had one out of the four. Which I was really disappointed about. I was sort of kicking myself because I thought, oh, I should have just ordered them offline. Um, but anyway, you know, it, it's happened. So yeah, I picked myself and Jess up one of these glitter orange pumpkin bubble bars. Is that what they're called? Yeah, bubble bars. So yeah, it's called the sparkly bubble bar. Oh my god, it smells insane, and I feel like, oh my god, look what's happened now, guys. These are so sparkly. Oh, I'm going to have to wipe that on my bed. So yeah, these were £5 each, I think, so not the cheapest, but so cute. So yeah, got us one of those, and then I will show you the pyjamas, but Jess has actually picked out the pyjamas. I believe they're from Boohoo. So yeah, so excited for those. But yeah, anyway, I feel like this video has gone on for so long and I've been really rambly and talkative. So yeah, I do apologize. But then again, if you don't like chatty videos, you probably have already clicked off by now. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching my Halloween haul with me. My first ever one on this channel, which makes me so happy. There's gonna be so many more. Like I said, if you do wanna see a Halloween decor video, then do let me know and I will do that for you. But yeah, I really hope you have enjoyed this video. Get yourself to HomeSense if you do love Halloween and wanna get yourself some bargains because they will go so quick because everything is literally like 50% off. But yeah. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I shall see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.